All right, guys, you've seen me play a single hand of blackjack. Now let's try this one with <clears throat> three multiple hands of blackjack, shall we? All right, good. Let the show begin. Put these cards back in the deck after being played out the first few hands. Shuffle them up. the game. Burn a card here on the house. And we have a seven coming out. <clears throat> coming out with a bankroll of $100. Good luck. We're going to play three hands each worth $10. Right, the show must go on. Jack Six, queen, either shows up card of seven, 20, 10, 19, showing against seven, stay, double down on 10 against se uh, seven, sorry, that was 15, we want to over bet, we're not going to double for more, but we got 16, 19 stays, dealer flips over a Jack and has 17. The double down loses, and the other two hands win. Now remember you're starting with a bankroll of $100. You have 20. 20. Count that out. <clears throat> Put aside $20. 20. 40. 60. You still have a hundred dollars to bet. Let the show go on. Like get get it in for three hands of twenty dollars a piece. That's your hand. So you have ace, ten, jack, up card eight for the dealer. First hand blackjack, second hand twenty, last hand sixteen. Blackjack pays three to two. One, two, three, four. Five, six. There we go. Blackjack taken away and put into the discard tray. 20 stays, 16 surrenders. And that's, that's good. 21, uh, 11, 21. Well, you did good on the blackjack. The other two hands, well, what are you going to do? We have 40 here. 50. You still have a bankroll of 100. So we're going to bet one hand 60, another hand 40, not a third hand included. So you have three, nine, up card eight showing, 11, 19 against eight. Flip hand one hits and gets 20. And 19 stays, eight pulls over a king, he has 18, and you win double your bankroll. $200. Let's color that up to quarters, shall we? Or what you could do is keep 100 nickels and just color this up to a black chip in case, in case you need to color up when you lose the nickels. Now we bet three hands again for $20 still. And we have the first card of eight, two, queen, up card three showing, 14, eight, 20, with three showing. 
We stand on 14 against 3, as basic strategy will tell you. The next thing you want to do is try to double on 8 in order to get a 18 or a soft 19. And you have 14. 20 stays. 8. 8 plus 7 is 15. And 8 is a bust. So, we have 20 here. That one. Double 20. One, a double bet. And 21. Not 21 as per so. 20 won the bet. So next, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Mark that up to quarters. One hand 50, a hand 100, and one hand $60. Let's up our bankroll, baby. 50 has ace, 100 has two, 60 has four. There's a three shown for the dealer. The first hand has 17, nine, six against three. Soft 17 wants to hit. Soft 17 hits with an 8 and has 15. That's a standoff. 9 will take a hit. 9 plus 6 is 15. Stay. 6 takes a hit. 11 takes a hit. 12 stays against 3. So 3 pulls a 7 and has 10. And that's 20. And all 3 bets are losers. Okay, it's a chance of a lifetime to win big money. That can happen. Seventy dollars, one hand. Ace, up card two. Four fourteen against two. Hit. Hit. Stay. 12, 15, 20. That's a loss. In the end result, <clears throat> if you have good credit, you will be comped to get another $100, and the show goes on. So bet 20, 20 plus 20, 20, 40, and another 40 at the end. Three. Jack. Jack. Up card ace. 414. 19. 20. Check for blackjack with an ace and no blackjack. Hit. Hit. stays, 20 stays. So the next thing you know, dealer flips over an 8, has a 19, that's a push, that's a win. Thus concluding with 40 and 40 is 80, plus another 40 is 120. Bet the full Monty to conclude the game, and you have eight. An eight showing. 17 against eight, you stay. 19, you're a defeated loser. That's a loss. I wonder what card I would have got on 17 if I had drawn. And nine, whatever. Well, the show's over. That's all for now.